What's up, YouTube? Look at this. This is a U-joint of my 1987 Chevy. And can you believe I greased it regularly, but something happened inside and the grease was not able, able to get through it. And as you can see what happened here, the grease didn't make it to the caps and they rusted out internally. I thought about trying to save it, but it's junk. I don't think I could save that. See? The grease didn't make it through to the caps and that's what happened. And now we're going on to something else. Can you guys believe I put a lawnmower on the roof of my shed? We're walking back there right now. Just give me one minute. Yeah, I put a new you joint in the truck yesterday. Yeah, I gotta climb up this ladder. Can you believe I used to I used to come along and uh, change some straps and my neighbor helped and we put this up on the roof. This is a 1985 Craftsman lawn tractor. A long time ago, an old man actually gave this thing to me and it ran. I drove it, drove it, kept topping the oil off, the thing smoked like crazy, even changed the oil a few times and one day the starter had gone bad and parked it and sat for for a little while and tires rot out in the front. I tried I tried putting some um, what they call navel navel jelly on it to to, to 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 dissolve the rust. It's an eight horsepower. You have eight horsepower craftsman. Isn't that crazy? I put this lawnmower on the roof of my shed. I I, 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 I figure it would look good up here. Yeah, that's all it needs is a starter and you know maybe some tires and get the oil leak fixed and that'll be drivable. Look at that. Yeah, that's a bumper off an old truck from the I would say the 40s right there. It's an old plow back there. Yep, 1985 Craftsman Lawn Tractor, and I still have the book to it. Isn't that crazy? I was painting a while back, and actually then got a little paint on it.